So I wanna make a quick video to talk about some amazing news. So if you're using Houdini at all and you're using it with Unreal Engine or Unity, there's a couple different ways you could be using it. The default way is you could make an asset inside of Houdini and then export it and just kind of have it as like an FBX or an effect that's not really editable anymore. And what you would have to have done in the past if you were a commercial user was buy an additional piece of software called the Houdini engine. And that little piece of code would run inside of Unreal Engine or Unity and allow you to basically procedurally adapt and change your assets inside of Unreal Engine or in Unity. So what do I mean? Let's say that you made a, um, a dynamic ladder inside of Houdini and you change its height or its width you wouldn't be able to do that once you exported it to Unreal Unity before without paying for this additional tool, and now they've made it free. So why is this so awesome? Well, basically it's gonna allow the industry to start moving in a better direction, where if anyone makes a Houdini asset and you open up their project, you're not gonna have to worry if you didn't pay for the additional license, which is awesome because it's gonna start making people want to use Houdini a little bit more. This is gonna be great for them as well. Actually, I think this is a really good business move because it's ultimately gonna allow people to um, start wanting to use Houdini more in their projects because you don't have this kind of encumbering step once you get into the game engine. Um, they do have a, an FAQ on their site that kind of talks about what and uh, how you'll be able to use it. So you're gonna to have to make sure you're on um, 18.5.499 this is basically to make sure that the licensing manager, if you've ever worked with Houdini, it has this secondary thing to make sure that everything is legit. Um, it has to be on this version for it to work because it can't validate it if it's not. Um, so that's good to know. And again, we can kind of see where the different costs are, when you would need to use them or pay. Um, and for now, you can see that now we've included a free version for um, Unity and Unreal, which is pretty cool. So again, I thought this was pretty great news. Um, if you're not using Houdini um, in your games or in your projects, I think it's worth at least investigating with an indie license, um, just exploring it. Um, it does limit some of the features in terms of what you can export and how you can work with it, but um, it really does feel like the feature going forward. Um, so yeah, just wanted to share this quick little tidbit with you guys and let you all know that the Houdini engine is now free. Um, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.